Hey, this is Michael Galbart, and I'm with Shift in Perspective, and you've reached my YouTube channel. I'd love for you to subscribe. What I bring here is a variety of different kinds of healing modalities and practices and skill sets that help us to navigate our lives better. I uh, work with couples and individuals who have distress patterns based in historical trauma, generational traumas, and personal development challenges that we all have in our own ways, and also collective, um, collective distress, which of course we're all subject to in this crazy world of ours. So I invite you to subscribe. And what I wanna talk about today is feedback, the art of feedback and communications. Sometimes, often, we receive feedback that we're not inviting or isn't welcome. We often, many of us have sensitivity to feedback and it can be very difficult to hear depending on someone's approach and their intentions. And so receiving feedback in itself is an art, how to be non-defensive in our listening, how to be really able to empathize with somebody's distress that they're in or where they're coming from. And sometimes it's just not welcome and we have to protect ourselves and our boundaries and our sense of ourself from feedback that doesn't feel accurate and feels like projection, which oftentimes it is if someone else hasn't done their own work. So there's this art of receiving feedback and there's this art of giving feedback. And what I've done with my girlfriend, uh, Beatrice, we've put together 10 steps to think 10 times before giving feedback. And there's a variety of, of, uh, of principles and practices here that can be very useful. I'll just mention a few and then I'll invite you to subscribe here to this, um, to my YouTube channel. And uh, you, will, you can receive then uh, a copy of what I call the 10 principles of the art of feedback. And just a few. So one is that it's really helpful to do our work first. Like, why do we want to give feedback to this person? Is it, is the relationship something we have skin in the game about? Uh, is it, um, have we done our own clearing work to look at what our part is in that cycle? Are we able to approach the person with kindness and respect? Are we able to invite the person to a clearing rather than enforcing that or demanding that? Are we able to ask the other person, especially when there's a mutual triggering? Right, we have grievances, many couples, friends, uh, siblings, uh, parents and children have mutual, have co-triggers and, uh, and grievances that need to be clear. In fact, an accumulation of grievances, right, that builds up in, as gunk inside of our relational systems, right? So if we can, high level of skill is to actually invite the other person to, if they have anything they, they want to clear, right? And to let them clear first. So, and then we can practice and show them what reflective listening is like, what acknowledging is like, what empathizing first is like, what understanding first is like. Because that's, to me, that's the art of feedback is really being able to both receive and give and by giving, actually, giving understanding and reflections that see the other person as they see themselves, which is the art of being tactful. So that's what I would say for now. And I invite and welcome your comments, your examples. I, a couple of weeks ago, what triggered this was I gave someone, a friend of mine, feedback about something that I felt uh, was important and that relationship is important to me. And it was important for me to clear or I was going to hold something, some resentment there. So, but the way I gave the feedback landed badly. And I can say on my, on my part, um, wasn't well delivered in my approach. And so it didn't go well. And I just lost it. <laughs> so, right, we're imperfect. Like Michael uh, Jordan said, we, he fails over and over again. And that's how he succeeds. So in the, uh, as far as then receiving feedback, I received some feedback from someone that was really hard to receive and I took it badly. So that's why this is an art. It is it's like going to the gym, the feedback gym, you know, you don't just go once and you're done, you know, you practice. So that's what I want to offer you today. Again, I'm Michael Gelbert with Shift in Perspective, my website, intimacyperspectives.com. 
If you're on my YouTube channel, I'd love to hear your comments and feedback. And thanks so much for uh, staying attuned for five minutes with me. Be well.